Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music and in today's lesson I want to teach you how to play the very awesome Numa Numa song, okay? So I'm going to teach you how to play the very catchy chorus section, okay? So before I start teaching you how to play, I'm going to quickly give you a quick preview of on what it sounds like and what it looks like, okay? So here's a quick preview, it goes somewhere like this, check it out, it goes like this. Okay, so let's go ahead and start teaching you how to play this chorus section. So, right hand, it starts on the C up here. So middle C is here. We go up an octave to this C, okay? So, starting on the C, and then the next note is B, C, and then A, and then A up to C, A, G, E. Okay, so that's the first part of the chorus section. Let's do it again. So right hand one more time for this first part. It goes like this. We have C, B, C, A, A, C, A, G, down to E like that for the right hand, okay? So... That's the right hand for the first part. The rhythm for this first part goes like this. So it's a kind of upbeat, or um, it's like a uh, leading onto this. So it goes one, two, three, four. Mm. Dun, 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 dun. Like that, okay? So it's kind of a lead up. So the C and B, C, first three notes of the right hand is a lead up. So it goes one, two, three, four, one, two, three, Okay, the E is only one, two for the last bit because the next part, the second part, it continues on. It's like the next upbeat to it. But anyway, yeah, so that's the rhythm to it. Make sure you practice it and get the rhythm because it doesn't sound right if it's in the wrong rhythm and wrong placement. Okay, so it goes. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, just like that. Okay, so once you get the right hand like that, the left hand we have two chords for this first part. Okay, so remember these first two chords because um, these two chords is the first two chords in the four chord series that pretty much uh, make up the whole song. Okay, the whole song is only made up of four different chords and there's four different chords cycle again and again in this Numa Numa song. Okay, so really important for you to remember these chords. So the first two chords are F major, which is F, A, and C. And then the second chord is C major, which is C, E and G. Okay, so with these two chords in mind, so F major followed by C major, the two hands would go like this. So check it out, right hand starts on the C, B, C, and after the C, F major by itself, and the right hand comes in, A, A, C, A, G, and then E and C major together, just like that. Okay, so that's the first part of the Numa Numa. Okay, so one more time, it goes like this. Here. Together, two, like that. Okay, and that's the first part of the chorus, okay? Moving on to the second part of the chorus, right hand continues up to the C, up to the E, down to D, C, down to G, and then G again, up to D, C, B, C, B, A, like that for the right hand, okay? So that's the right hand for the second part, okay? So one more time, so it goes like this, it goes, C, E, D, C, G, and then G up to D, C, B, C, B, A, like that for the right hand. Okay, so that's the right hand for the second part. Um, the left hand, we have uh, two chords, okay? So actually before we do that, the right hand, the rhythm is pretty straightforward. It's all continuous notes, so it goes, um, okay, so one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, like that. Okay, so that's the right hand, so make sure you get it. Like that, okay, so that's the right hand. Once you get it, the left hand, we have the next two chords in the four chord series, which are the other two chords you have to remember. Okay, so the two chords are G major, which is G, B, and D, followed by A minor, which is A, C, and E. Okay, so with these two chords in mind, so G major followed by A minor, the two hands together would go like this, okay? Right hand, it goes like this, let me see, okay, right hand starts on the C, E, D, C, and 
then G and G major together. C and then G, D, C, B and then C and A minor together. Just like that, okay? So one more time, so it goes like this. It goes together. Together. Just like that. Okay. So that's the second part of the chorus section, okay? So so far, the first two part that we've learned would be played back to back like this. Check it out. So it goes like this. Okay, so it's harder when it's faster, so make sure you practice slowly first. So just go somewhere like this. Dun, 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 Like that, okay? So rhythm is most important, so make sure practice slowly first. Even that speed is a bit too fast, so if you can go even slower, that'll be better. Make sure you get the rhythm first, then slowly build your way up, okay? But anyway, let's go ahead and move on to the, um, Third part of the song, okay, so third part of the chorus, right hand continues on, goes C, B, C, A, and this time it changes, instead of A, C, A, G, E, it goes A, B, A, G, E, so instead of C, it replaced with B this time, okay, so that's the third part, okay, one more time, so that's pretty much the same as the first part, except the only difference, you can just uh, recognize it just then, I said, replace the last, second half of it with the, with the C, with the B, okay? So C replaced with B, okay? So anyway, yeah, so it goes like this. The right hand goes C, B, C, A, and then A, B, A, G, E, like that. So replace with the B, okay? And the last bit of it, okay? But anyway, that's the right hand for the third part. Uh, the left hand, super simple because it's the same two chords as the first two chords in part one, okay? So pretty much it's cycle back of the um, four chord series, as I said before, is F major, which is F, A, C, followed by C major, which is C, E, and G. Okay, so with those two chords in mind, so F major, followed by C major, okay, so with those two chords, the two hands together, we'll just go like this, it's the same placement as the um, first part with the substitution of the B, uh, and that's it, okay? But all the chords and the notes of the right hand is played at the same places. So it goes like this, it goes dun, 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 after the C, F major by itself, A, A, B, A, G, and then E and C major together, just like that, as I said. It's the same placement, okay? So one more time for the third part, it goes dun, 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 here. Together, like that, okay? And that's that for the third part. So, same place, and remember that. So, so far, the three uh, parts that I've learned in the song would be played back to back like this. Like that. Okay, moving on to the fourth and pretty much last part of the section before it repeats again in this chorus. The right hand continues on like this, goes up to the C, up to the E, D down to B, D, back down to B, C, A, like that for the right hand, okay? So that's the right hand for the fourth part of this chorus section. Let's do it again, so the right hand goes C up to E, D, down to B, D, and then down to B, C, A, like that for the right hand, okay? So that's the right hand for the fourth part. So one more time, I guess, C, E, D, B, D, B, C, A, like that. So the rhythm is like C and then E, D, and then B, D, and then B, C, A. So it's kind of grouped with E, D, and then grouped with B, D, and then grouped with B, C, okay? So that's the right hand for the fourth part. Left hand, uh, we have the um, two chords, the uh, last two chords in the four chord series, which you know it's the same two chords as the second part, okay? So those two chords are G major, which is G, B, D, and A minor, which is A, C, E, which you know already, okay? So G major and A minor. So the turns together for this fourth part just goes like this. Right hand starts with this C, E, D, after D, G major by itself. Right hand comes in, B, D, B, C, and after C, A minor by itself. And A, like that. Okay, one more time, so it goes like this. Here. Here. Like that, and that's it. So that's the four parts, so make sure you play it back to back again, so you repeated the whole four parts again to pretty much make the second half of the whole chorus, okay? So pretty much what I taught you in the lesson is the four parts, you just play that for two times, okay? So pretty much like this. So, 
that's pretty much it for this lesson, okay? So I played the entire song, including the intro, the Maya He, that part and all this kind of stuff. You can check that out in the cover. And yeah, as for now, I guess, enjoy your time. I did the verse and all this kind of stuff in the, uh, uh, whatever the cover so check that video out It's probably the video before this video because I always do the cover first by ear and improvisation first Then I do the tutorial like this. But anyway as for now. Yeah, enjoy your time on my channel checking out all my other meme Piano covers. I've done so many memes the dankest memes of them all in the music form But anyway, uh, enjoy those and enjoy my other piano covers and tutorials on the channel I have over 1,800 of them so many for you to enjoy and learn from but anyway Yeah, enjoy your time on my channel and I for now see you next time I'm glad you made it to the end of my video. Now you can visit my website to learn how to play this or any song you want through my methods explained through books and courses. Or just get me to make a full song video lesson or sheet music transcription on any song you want using my customized services. As for now, enjoy your time on my channel, subscribe and see you next time.